was no sign of anyone being there. Wait. Tried to be smooth with that. Didn't work. Hey guys, Pony here. Welcome back to the Pokemon X Wonderwalk. And I've been trying to do this for hours. I was testing out the whole language change thing that I was talking about with Pokemon Yellow if I try to download it on this DS. And so I downloaded a random game on my DS. It was just like, I just need a random game. It was Pushmo. I'll, I'll explain that later. Come on, this way. Of course, I try to explain something. All this dialogue is going to happen. So this is the house. It is a scary house, isn't it? Well, I guess we should go inside. What? You're going inside? Are you all serious? Serena's off spending time with her Pokemon, so I guess we'll have to go in without her and see if the rumor is true by ourselves. Oh god. <laughs> I guess so. Let's go inside by ourselves then. Just walk into this house. There's a dude in here. Let's get started then. How did we. No introduction? We're just gonna walk into the house. The dude immediately, was, immediately wants to tell us a story. Like, no, who are you? Why'd you barge into my house? This isn't abandoned. Let's get started. All these angles. It was a dark and stormy night. Many years ago. Lost, I arrived at this house and went inside. The lights would not turn on. So I fearfully looked around the house. Eventually, I made my way into the kitchen. There was no sign of anyone being there. Wait. Wait. Tried to be smooth with that. Didn't work. Eventually, oh, there was no sign of anyone being there. I found the fridge, and when I opened it, a faint light leaked out. I could finally make out my surroundings, and I saw the faint outline of a man huddling in the corner of the room. I tried to tell him that I was lost, and I was hoping he'd let me stay until morning. But when I approached him, the man suddenly screamed, STAY BACK! I apologized and continued to plead my case. Please. Can't you help me? I'm not talking to you, he shouted. I looked at the man in surprise. When I did this, the man asked me, Can't you see them? Behind you! A horde of faceless men! Well, now then, since I told you a wonderful story that will always haunt you, would you be so kind as to tip me? Sure. If you don't, you might see something really scary. This is a scam. This is just an absolute... Exactly, Shauna. Thank you. Anyway. Took my headphones off that time. Because that was too difficult. You're charging us? Even haunted houses aren't free, you know. Would you like to give a tip? Sure, I got money to blow. Sheesh, let's get out of here. Huh? Is it over already? I was really listening. Heh, <laughs> Trevor. Was that story you just told us really true? No answer. <sighs> I guess it really was a scary house, in a way. Well, you know what? I know you wanted to go camping, and that was kind of like camping, I guess. People usually tell scary stories by a campfire, right? I've had enough of dark places and scary things. I'd rather rehearse my dances. I'll see you all later. 
What should I do next? I'll go to Levere City! See you later, Brandon. Please compare Pokedexes with me again soon. Sean is going to say one final thing. Or not. Hello? Okay. Why don't... Okay. You don't leave. But anyway, like I was saying, I tried to test the language thing with, like, Pushmo, but I guess because it's comparing that being a 3DS game to the Pokemon games coming out being on Virtual Console, maybe that would take make a difference. Or the fact that I only changed the language to English and I didn't change the region? I have no idea, but it didn't seem to work. But then, the homebrew menu successfully launched two times while I was doing that. Two times in a row, but then right after that, after I closed the menu, I was like, oh, I kind of want to go, I kind of want to record some Pokemon X, but then right after I tried to do that, it wouldn't open. It just kept crashing, and I've been trying to get it up ever since. Yeah, Gengarite. Man, I wish I had my Haunter right now. I'm all alone. Aw. No. Wait, what does this say? Ooh, encounter. Wait, encounter, right? Or does that mean no surfing? Can I fish? I can fish! I connected to the internet. Good. Okay, I had to be really careful with it that time. Because I don't want the same thing that happened last time to happen again. Shift. going to happen. Can I fish over a bridge? Why? It makes sense. People do that? Kind of. Wait, what? You have brown hazel and gray lenses. Uh oh. It tells me the lenses I have. Okay. Good. Why is it? It's so hard to fish with this compared to my new 3DS. New 3DS XL. Okay. Let's just catch you. You're level 15. Pokeball. Because you don't matter. And oh, nothing. Double slap. Smack. Smack. It's gonna hit me three times. Like, that makes sense. That makes sense. Great ball. It's blue. You wanna get in the blue ball? You wanna get in the blue ball, right? Yeah, you wanted to get in the blue ball. Okay. Sweet. Okay, now let's see what we get for this polywag. I hope it's something interesting. I really want to use. Oh my god. <laughs> Modest nature match carp. That's amazing. <laughs> well, I mean, flamethrower, surf, ice beam. That's actually viable. That actually makes sense. Even though your physical attack is better. And when you're Maggie, you're water dark. Do you get dark pulse? I have time to look this one up. Or not.
Nope. Oh, Oris. Well, Oris is different. Like, overall, what do you get as special moves? Oh, Scald. Jeez. Well, I knew Fire Blast and Flamethrower. I also knew Thunder and Thunder. Yeah, there's actually a good special moveset for Gyarados. And I can't believe they didn't give him Crunch until Oris. Like, he had Bite in X and Y, but then in Oris they updated to give him Crunch for the Water Dark Mega. Oh, with Poke Rust. This is an 8 gem slave, though. Why would you... Why? Why would you teach all your HMs to a protean frogadier? Why? I want you. I want you on this team. I could have a Gardevoir, a Talon, play a Mana Greninja. I could have the the ultimate generic OU team. What do I have as far as healing items? Because there is a gym. Oh wait, yeah, I bought a crap ton of Hyper Potions before. How many of those do I have left? Yeah, I have 18. I'm good. Going into a fairy gym, though. I'm gonna need something for the fairy types. Please don't run into a fairy psychic immediately. I really want to use this thing. I haven't used it since it evolved. No. Wait, actually, before we go into the gym, I want a new hat. Hello, welcome. If you'd like, check the items at the back of the shop. Huh. Huh. Nah, that's pink. V neck. Sure. Oh, back of the shop. Back? Are they implying this is the back of the shop? The only items here? Okay. I really want to just do one of these random but No, that's a multi-battle, no. Um... I don't want the hat. I... Nah. Nah. No. Okay. Let's go into the gym. A lot of people never see this gym when they go into this town. Even though it has the little gym statue next to it. And just because I played the game. But like after a year of not playing the game, people will not remember. Um fight you. Let's see what Trigology can do. Please don't have a Psychic type. Or the fairy ground that doesn't exist. <laughs> the only thing I won't like is Gardevoir. I think there are some Curlias in this gym. Which is weird because they would have Gardevoirs by now. Sludge Bomb! Okay then. I resist that. I used to be weak to it, now I resist it. <laughs> Die! You're dead. This thing is overpowered. You're level 49. <laughs> Azumarill! Oh, I so would kill you. But, you are powerful. Um, I can kill it. Probably the only thing on my no, I have an 11 level advantage on this gym, so yeah, I could kill it with anything on my team. I feel so bad right now. I hate these kinds of gyms where you just go in the warp pads because it's not really even a puzzle. No, Matthias, no. Oh my god. Clock. <laughs> yeah, it was like six. It was no five forty-five when I started recording. So it's six now. 
technically my computer says 602, but apparently it's 6 o'clock. No, my watch says 602 also. Weird. Can I just drink all G Sweet? I'll give other things a chance. Fairy's not weak to anything but poison and steel, though. So it's not like I'll want to use anything else. I mean, fire resists it, so I could go into Talon Flame, but other than that, it's nothing really desirable. Um. Thank you. Thank you? I mean, I'm kind of over leveled as it is, so I don't necessarily need an experience point power. Slurpuff. <laughs> Slurpuff. Let's see what Dragon Pulse does. Oh, wait, I'm an idiot. Wait, I'm an idiot. Why am I worried about psychic types? I'm putting a Dragon type out in a fairy gym. That was a complete misclicking -cl Dragon Pulse, but. Jeez! Wow! Risking everything. Then again, doesn't poison resist. Bleh. Doesn't poison resist fairy? If not, well. <laughs> Screw it. Hi. Oh, hi. <laughs> well, we're halfway through the episode and already fighting Jim here. Oh, if it isn't a young trainer. So you've flown all the way through my gym, fluttering down to me on a fortunate wind. And I suppose you have earned yourself the right to a battle as a reward for your efforts. I am Valerie, who leads the fairy type gym. I hope your visit will prove entertaining to you. The elusive fairy types may appear frail as a breeze of delicate and delicate as a bloom, but they are strong. This is true. They are broken, as a matter of fact. They need some more weaknesses. Ah, crap. Forgot about steel types. Dang it. Why well, did I forget about steel? Mawile exists. Oh, God. Ha! Screw you, Mawile! And die. Give me that speed boost. You're gonna die to burn. That's gonna do what? No, it's gonna do half damage you too, so yeah. That makes sense. Yeah, you died to burn! Yay! I kinda wanted to kill you myself since I have speed anyway and get that extra speed. Okay. Okay. And Mr. Mime. That's another fairy psychic. Okay. I have... I have dark on my poison type. Let's see. What do I have? I have bug. Which could work. Yeah, you have X-Scissor, right? Let's see. It's Psychic. Fairy does not resist bug. We're good. Yeah, Fairy doesn't resist bug. If that was the case, Fairy Psychic would be... overpowered as crap. Oh, nice! Actually makes sense. Even though I could probably just hit that Sylveon with a sludge bomb. Although I am scared of a moon blast. Just to check. I'm pretty sure it does, but 
need to move the wire out of the way of my keyboard because that would pull my DS off the screen. Um, uh, go over Trigology, but I need to check to make sure that poison does resist fairy. Yes, yes it does. Okay, yeah. Moonblast will be neutral. And I can hit it with a sludge bomb. I realized I got that plus one with flame charge for nothing. Die! Yeah, you're dead. Didn't even get to see the light of day. Oh god, I need to stop training this thing. You were my lowest level at one point. Okay, that happened. Yes, that was a fine battle. I shall reward you with this great, for this great victory. This is the fairy badge. It is yours now. Its beauty is captivating, is it not? Hmm. Ah, do forgive me. I was so captivated. I forgot a moment that it is yours. It's, um, wings. I guess that one's kind of obvious. Um, I don't know, half oval? This captivating pink watermelon? I don't know. This captivating fairy badge will endear any Pokemon up to level 80 to you. Yes, even those Pokemon that you may receive from others will obey you. I also wish to award you with this TM. Please consider it a personal gift from me, not simply the winnings of a battle. Dazzling Gleam. Nice. Oh! My, what a curious feeling. I can't seem to recall any longer which move is contained in that TM. I hope you might forgive me. My designs are said to be rather mystifying. Do you agree with that? I've always wanted to be a Pokemon, you see? That desire is my inspiration and what I try to achieve by designing. And yet, the only time I feel I am tr truly one with Pokemon is when we are embroiled in desperate battle. I wonder why that is. Hmm, could it be? Never mind, it's nothing, kind trainer. That's weird, she forgot what TM was in it. That's the first time they've ever done that. I feel like something's gonna happen when I walk out of here. Yep. Oh, Pokeball Factory! Hi, Brandon! Hey, that's the fairy badge! It's so cute and sparkly! Know what? We're going to go on tour of the Pokeball Factory. Come with us! I'm interested in Pokeballs because they're used to catch Pokemon. Put it another way, I'm utterly fascinated by them. And we get to fight Team Flare. So now that I've gotten to use Dragalchi, <laughs> I'm switching that thing out. And then... Um, I would say let's give Butterfree some love, but fire types. Sand Slash. Yeah. Screw it. I haven't gotten to use Earthquake yet. I also haven't gotten to use Dragon Pulse, but that's because I just bought a bunch of fairy types. I went in, I went in sweeping the gym with the one thing that was weak to them. Or that had one typing that was weak to them. And immune by them. That gym was easy, probably because I'm using the experience here. Everything is easy in this game with that thing. I would say I regret using it, but nah. Let's see. How vexing. He won't let us inside the Pokeball Factory. Here's where it starts. He'll let us in, you'll see. I'll go talk to him again. Shona, wait. And now they come down? Oh, not yet. <clears throat> Did Shawnee and Travs go running off just now? What's the deal? We were supposed to meet here, too. I wonder what the matter is. Yeek! Bye! Stop! Oh, I didn't read the text. Huh? Hmm. What's going on? Well, I guess I'll go help them. 
Team Flare? There might be something happening inside. Let's go check it out while the guard is gone. Okay. Da 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 Hi, friend. Can that idiot outside even handle guard duty? So sorry, but we're not offering tours right now. With a red suit like that, you must be a member of Team Flare, right? Did you take Did you take a part-time job at the Pokeball Factory to pay for that ugly suit? Oh, she just called you ugly. What? How dare you mock Team Flare? Do you see like a, are you two gonna fight or something? Mighty Anna, get them! I'll take care of this. You go on ahead. Um. And I guess with that, this is where I'll end it. So, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Remember to like the video, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you all later. Goodbye. <laughs>